Hey, and welcome back to the channel. So, I've been dealing with a problem in my fish farm, and I wanted to share it with you. There's a sneaky predator messing with my fish fry and that means, and it's something I never really paid attention to before. Damsel fly thing. These little guys might look harmless, but they are actually mini assassins in the water. Let's take a look at what's going on and what I'm doing to stop them. But before I dive in, if you enjoy content about aquarium, tropical fish, and fish breeding, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Your support helps the channel grow and reach more people who love aquarium fish as much as we do. So. Here's the deal, these damn cell fly nymphs are basically tiny predators that love to snack on my fish fry and that. They start off in the water before they turn into those delicate looking damsel flies you see hovering around. But in this stage, they are ruthless just when I think my fish fry are growing nicely, I notice fewer and fewer of them. And guess who's to blame? Yep, these guys right here. It's frustrating to think that something so small can make such a big impact. Let me show you exactly how they hunt. Check this out. These damn cell fly nymph are hanging out in the water just waiting for the right moment and boom it grabs a Daphnia with its extendable jaws imagine this happening in my ponds over and over again no wonder my Daphnia culture was struggling and it doesn't stop there if they can take out Daphnias this easily you bet they are going after my baby fish too over time, they just pick them off one by one. By the way, if you're liking this information so far, make sure to give the video a like and subscribe. It really helps the channel and keeps me motivated to share more fish farming experiences. Now, how do they even get here? Well, it turns out that adult damn cell flies lay their eggs right on the water. Once they hatch, the nymphs grow underwater and turn into these sneaky predators. And if you are not careful, you have an entire army of them in your pond before you know it. That's why I set up this wire mesh to keep them from getting into my Daphnia culture. But what about my ponds? That's where things get tricky. So. How do I deal with them? First off, manual removal. Yeah, it's a pain. But if you see these guys in your pond, you gotta scoop them out ASAP. Another method is using fine mesh covers or netting over the ponds to keep the adult damsel flies from laying their eggs in the first place. Will I have to cover all these ponds? That is tough for the moment. It won't eliminate the problem completely, but it helps reduce their numbers. And of course, keeping the pond clean helps a lot too. Less debris means fewer hiding spots for them. Regular maintenance can go a long way in keeping these predators in check. At the end of the day, damselfly nymphs are just part of nature. But that doesn't mean I want them taking out my fish fry. It's all about balance and making sure they don't get out of control. If you've had these problems before, let me know in the comments. What did you do to handle it? Well, I just wanted to share this problem that I'm facing day by day at the farm. And just wanted to let you know that it's a normal problem that we need to deal with if we have this open fish farm setup. Thanks for watching 
and don't forget to like, subscribe for more fish farming tips and experience. Catch you in the next one.